I am excited about this Canva Translate option that uses part of their AI software. Um, and you can really translate lots of different things really quickly. Keep in mind, you can upload anything into Canva, and so the sky is really the limit. I found this infographic already completed within Canva. I didn't have to create a single thing. But what I'm gonna do is make this a little bit more friendly for our English language learners. To do that, I am going to uh, scroll down to this translate button. If you don't see it, it will be under the more button that will be the last button on the list. It's just, once you click on it, it's available right there as something to select. So I can automatically detect the language or I can select the language that it is. I'm gonna leave it automatically detect and I'm going to translate it to Spanish. And I am going to apply to page one because that's the only page that I have. So page one and choose translate. It is translating that. And what's interesting is it did not hurt our original, but it did translate everything here into um, Spanish. Now, I need to double check that uh, the order here would be the correct abbreviation. So there's a few things to check, uh, but it does save you lots and lots of time. Let's go ahead and translate. Oops, let me delete that. Let's translate again. We're gonna do page one only, only now we are going to translate to, let's do Urdu. So again, this isn't going to be perfect and your students who speak that language will tell you this isn't perfect. Um, and given the nature of the character, sometimes there's a little bit of adjustment that you have to make, but it is a really great option to save you some time on the workflow of creating these sorts of things. And so that is Canva Translate.